Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around December 1st. So we're just going to see what comes up. I just wanted to let you know those to those people that I did private readings for today. Uh, that was great. Every single one of you guys, I really enjoyed it a lot. So just wanted you to know. So anyway, what do we have for a message today? It's been a long time since I've done private readings, so I think I kind of missed it. So, yeah. Queen of Wands. Queen of Wands is very confident, very determined, very proud, very optimistic. So this is a very um, strong energy. It's a very strong individual. Very, very... Um, creative, a need to get creative, perhaps. Somebody may need to get creative. Hmm. Hermit. Page of Wands reversed. Now, this is a need to go within, to withdraw. To reflect somebody needs to reflect they need to take some time they need to take time to think about something now I don't know if somebody has received some bad news or they are we going to be receiving some bad news I just got to be honest we got the page of wands in reverse that could be some bad news that is arriving this is uh, I you know a setback of some sort. Somebody may be making some sort of excuses, you know, procrastinating. You know, the Queen of Wands next to the Page of Wands, you know. Sometimes the Queen of Wands can be um, lazy, just being honest. Um, page of Wands reversed. Now that's the Page of Wands reversed actually can be lazy. Uh, need to get creative, need to find that ambition, that energy, that drive. Somebody needs to, maybe they need to get healthy. They need to come up with a plan. Somebody needs to come up with a plan. I mean, this is somebody that is very capable of success. You know, has the ability to be a leader. You know, so there's an ability to lead, lead but there's a need to not lose focus and get creative and really come up with a plan. Take time, go with set goals. So, yeah, I feel like we have somebody here that needs to set some goals. They need and they need to follow through. You know, when we get a page in reverse, that means there's lack of follow through. You know, which leads to a setback. This is somebody that makes excuses, that procrastinates, therefore things fail to get off the ground. So, interesting. But we do have an individual that definitely is very skilled and can do it. They can do whatever they put they, their mind to. <laughs> now, the hermit is about take time. Take time to come up with a plan. So, yeah, somebody needs to come up with a plan. Temperance card. Now, this is about changing and evolving and allowing so somebody uh, needs to be grounded, you know, they need to be realistic, but they also need to be fluid, okay? They need to be able to make changes in their life to be successful. Now this is changing, it's evolving, it's going with the flow. Um, it's time for a change. It's time for a change. Okay? And you can't, you can't let fear hold you back. Because if you think about the Queen of Wands, the Queen of Wands is fearless. Okay? So let go of fear. Don't let fear hold you back. It's definitely time for a change. And it's a major change. Because if you think about temperance, and I say this a lot, it comes after the death card. And the death card is a major change. So... 
something needs to end. It's the end of an old life, but the, the only way the old life is going to end if, is if you allow it to end, you know? Because you have to allow change to happen. So somebody needs to find their determination and their confidence and their uh, strength to uh, take action and come up with a plan to change their life by the looks of things. Anyhow, um, temperance. Temperance is a change. It's a change that is needed. Somebody needs to manage their feelings and they need to be patient. It's a card of patience. Be patient. Allow things to change with time. You think about hermit. It's time. Things don't change overnight. That doesn't mean you give up. That's lack of follow through. Just because things don't change overnight doesn't mean you give up. So somebody is giving up on, you know, Evolve something they're evolving or some sort of change they're giving up because they want it to happen fast and the Queen of Wands does want things to happen fast. This is somebody who needs patience. Now we all have this Queen in us so it could be any sign but there's a need to be patient you know uh, continue with the goal you know continue revising your goals You know, maybe you need to, you know, change them every so often as you evolve on this journey. Somebody is going on some sort of spiritual journey. They are on the path and path of spiritual awakening right here. But it, it doesn't happen overnight. And and there's going to be times where, you know, you get lazy. Well, and you procrastinate and you make excuses. But that doesn't mean you freaking stay there. So, you know, I feel like somebody needs to find their self-discipline to change. It's all about self-discipline. Page of Cups reversed. Now we got two pages reversed. We got somebody here that is, you know, they don't appear to be as mature as they should be. Just being honest, I mean, there's lack of maturity here with two pages in reversed. There's, um, I don't know, we may have a drama person here, somebody who's filled with drama. Um, there's a need to dream. There's a need to dream. Somebody may also, I'm going to change this up for somebody else, okay? Somebody may be receiving some bad news about, you know, somebody they were hoping for, you know? I mean, that page of wands reverse and the page of cups reverse is bad news. Maybe it's an unrequited love situation for somebody. You know, this isn't going to work out. Somebody has evolved you know, somebody could be hoping for a reconciliation and it's not going to happen. I'm just being honest with you. I'm just being honest. Somebody, you know, could also be realizing they may have seen some, seen, seen the light. You think about the hermit card. They could be realizing that they've changed and they no longer want to be in a relationship. Okay. This could be, uh... Somebody's changing, or they're or they're about to change. Um, they've come to some sort of realization, and it's going to take a lot of strength to change. It's going to take strength. This is about changing, and it's about stop making excuses, stop procrastinating. Somebody may be in an unrequited love situation where there's a lack of love, there's a lack of emotion. They may have their heart set on somebody that is emotionally unavailable. You know. Either way, a change is coming because this is an exchange. It is a change. Everything happens for a reason. Somebody needs to go within and they need to realize their true identity. They need to 
it's, these are both cards of time as well. It is it's time to realize basically who you are, how strong you are. That's what I see. It's it's a need to take the lead, to be the boss. Be the boss. Be the boss of your own life. Anyhow. Page of Cups reversed. What is this Page of Cups reversed? It's shattered dreams, but it's... Uh, Somebody is getting their bubble burst. You know, somebody's bubble may have been burst. All right. I don't know if there's some sort of tears or something. There could be a rejection. Somebody could be being rejected. I'm just being honest with you. They could be rejected. There's there's no passion. There's a lack of passion, lack of desire. Um, boring. Somebody may be very boring. Devil. Yikes. So I said what is the page of cups reversed, but I put it next to both those pages. The devil unhealthy codependency somebody is codependent on a unhealthy person okay because pages are people so they are they are codependent on something there could be some addictions well codependency is an addiction uh, we, these are both cards of addiction so somebody may have some sort of addiction and they need to find their self discipline to overcome it they may be their dreams may be shattered because their addiction is taking control and if you think about the queen of pentacles i mean or the queen of i'm sorry the queen of wands is very controlling energy i'm just being honest all about control self control a need to control somebody really needs to control their addictions you know or they're whatever it is they need to control and, and addictions come in many 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 forms somebody's addictions are holding them back from wish fulfillment per se anyhow um there's a need for moderation there there, there is with that temperance card there's a need to uh Somebody may need help. They may need rehab. You know, they may need some... I'm just saying be, they may need help. They may need some sort of rehab or something like that. Anyhow, I'm not sure if we have a drinking problem here or a drug problem or a food problem or something like that. Um, somebody may also ha have a self-image problem with these both of these pages reversed. Somebody has a self-image problem. Confidence. You know, lack of confidence. A lack of... Uh, self-esteem you know the devil has taken over you know the addiction has taken over um, or social pressure you know ego even somebody's ego pride whatever might be in the way of of happiness anyhow um, somebody needs to find their discipline their self-discipline to take charge and break free from an unhealthy situation that's what needs to happen, but they've been unable to do so. They need to come up with a plan. I feel like they are going to be coming up with a plan or these cards wouldn't be here. I feel where they've been, there's been unhappiness. There's It's been boring. It's been lackluster. It's been uh, toxic. Wherever they've been, it's been toxic. But it feels like they're, they're making some sort of de decision as we speak or they're going to be they're going to be coming up with some sort of plan or they're planning right now the lovers is going to be a separation somebody's going to this somebody's going to be separating they're going to be separating from that contract we've been talking about this i feel like they've suffered some sort of consequences and now they're aware because this is a high awareness this is a jesus consciousness somebody has become aware of a false contract that they have been bound to you see they're mirroring each other somebody has been bound to a false contract okay that doesn't really make them happy okay it not even exciting okay it's not even there's no there's no passion there it doesn't look like there's love there either but they've been bound to it because you know uh for one it was a karmic contract of some sort for two it filled a void you know and for three you know uh, 
the void not being alone same thing didn't want to be alone um it, there was some sort of addiction maybe maybe for sexual reasons you know some people you stay in a situation for that or materialistic the devil represents both um so somebody but there is going to be a separation because this car has been coming up a lot in reversed so this there's got, probably going to be a car uh, uh <laughs> I do feel like this is a karmic contract. But anyhow, this there's going to be um, a conflict, okay, or a detachment. Somebody's going to be detaching, and it's because they be, they're waking up. They're going through, this is a spiritual awakening. Somebody has evolved, they've changed, they've gone, or they're going through some sort of spiritual awakening. Um, so therefore, they're going to separate from the false contract. It's not going to be easy, but this person is gaining strength. They're gaining strength. They're gaining courage. It's interesting that I mentioned the Queen of Pentacles because that's what's on the bottom. So somebody, maybe, it's interesting. I just happened to, to look down. So, um, and there's creating something. So creating, creating something. Somebody is going to be creating um something new by the looks of things by separating from a false contract this is creating a masterpiece somebody's going to be creating a masterpiece but anyhow um this is i don't know realizing maybe through a period of isolation or some, or feeling isolated or being lonely you know you can be in a relationship and still be lonely but anyway, somebody is coming to some sort of con con conclusion. It's like they've seen the light and they think that they have realized that it's time for something better because the temperance card is, a, is an exchange for something better. It's time for a better life. The only way to have that better life is to separate from the false, you know, the toxic, uh, unhealthy contract. Right? I mean, that is exactly what that is. So, um, breaking free. This is freedom from something that is not meant to be. Out of self love. This is out of self love. But, I feel like there's also been one-sidedness in a relationship. You know, there's been a lot with both of these cards. There's been there's been some sort of one-sidedness. Now action is about to be taken because the wands cards, whether it's a king or a queen, is given to take action after procrastinating and not, you know, and staying bound, somebody is about to take action because they've seen, they now see, they've woken up, or they're waking up. It's going to be a disconnection. There is. Justice. Told you it was a karmic contract. Going right there. Karmic contract. I freaking knew it. I knew it. Absolutely. 100% karmic contract. It's the end of a karmic contract. I, I'm positive. I'm positive. Um, a decision is being made. A final decision about doing what's right. Doing what's fair. About bringing balance. Somebody is doing what they need to do to bring balance to a situation. There's, They've suffered some consequences though. Because a lover is reversed. It's kind of consequence. Up or upright. They, somebody has suffered some karmic consequences for uh, involving themselves in, in a contract, you know. Um, but now they've become enlightened. Time has changed somebody. It has. Everything is going to turn out as it should. With that justice card. That's the laws of karma. That sees straight through a situation. It sees right through everything. Huh. 
truth. Somebody is gonna gonna do the right thing. They're gonna be honest. They're gonna be do the right thing. That's the truth. The truth about a false partnership. Accepting the truth because this is accepting and seeing the truth. So somebody is gonna be seeing the truth about a false false contract. Hmm. Taking action to break free and be honest and upfront. There could be a conflict. Okay, there could be even news of legality. Somebody could be, you know, I don't know, going to court in the near future um, because there's a change that is on the horizon. Okay, and it is for the better. It is a it is a very very good change. world wow major change this is the end it's the end of a cycle it's the end of a phase somebody has learned a life lesson i'm telling you what somebody has learned a major life lesson this is a major completion of a karmic lesson this is a major accomplishment And this is accepting. It is accepting. This is going with the flow. Definitely with the temperance in the world card. Somebody is about to accept. They are about to accept. They are about to go with the flow. They are about to accept that something is over. They are completing one cycle and about to begin a new one. Serious evolution here. With these two cards. Serious, somebody has truly, truly evolved. There's pro there could there's this is like a whole this is like a whole new world that is about to begin. This is a change of residence as well. Somebody could be changing residences. We could be talking about a uh, anybody here. Okay, there could be a change on the home front. Somebody has learned a very, very, very big lesson. And now they're ending something big. They're ending that karmic lesson. They are. They've learned something. They've learned something through a karmic contract that has put in them, that has put in them, that has awakened them. So it's a spiritual awakening. Um, and there's going to be some tears shed, I believe. I think there's going to be, somebody's about to get their bubble burst because somebody's going to tell them exactly how they feel you know the truth is going to come out about to the false contract the false partner right the the partner that wasn't meant to be okay that wasn't meant to last that was here to teach a lesson is about to receive some uh truth okay is about to receive some truth and they're going to go through some spiritual awakening as well anyhow um this is all about awakening um somebody's about and the other person it's like the other the other woman or the other man you know the somebody or somebody is about to receive some bad news i hate to say that but that's what i see and I feel like there's it's been one-sided. I think the whole partnership was one-sided. And somebody is acting out of self-love. They're acting out of self-love. They're doing the right thing. And the world card is a major completion of a life lesson. Leaving something behind and starting a new journey. Somebody's going to be starting a new journey. This is a victory after sorrow. So it's the end. It's the end of a partnership or union with that lover's card that just was not compatible, unfortunately. And pretending that it is, is no longer working. Something's not working out. It's not working out. Wheel of Fortune reversed on the bottom now. So that's that's uh, somebody stuck. They've been clinging to control, 
refusing to move on but I feel like it's over it's over somebody has realized they've gone through some sort of awakening they've changed they know what they want and they're taking action to go after it and if you don't have the self-discipline to do so the time is now to find it good luck